Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh brothers and sisters I'm your brother Abdul Hamid from Insight into Islam I'm here in Gambia uh, checking our project Alhamdulillah today is my last day so I just want to show you the project uh, we did send a video but it was small um, but now I want to sh just show you uh, inshallah the project, the school and the masjid and the orphanage school uh, just want to give you a tour inshallah so barakallah fikum so this is we have uh, three doors here inshallah this is the first door this is the main entrance for the, mas for the masjid inshallah and then we have second door this one here is for the sisters entrance and then we have the big door here mashallah this one is the big door if you want to put you know if car comes if car can come inside and if they want to put anything something big they can use that inshallah and uh, so we're going to go now to entrance for the masjid inshallah the main side so alhamdulillah this is the entrance for the masjid uh, for the men. So this is the toilets. As you can see, uh, the toilet. This is all the toilets. There is still, when we say the project is finished, we don't mean it's 100% finished, but it means that it's ready for the students to come and stay. You know, they have the water, they have the electricity, and we want to open it before Ramadan as well, so people in the community can come and benefit. Mm. So this is going to be painted, needs painting. So this is the toilet. Well, this is the toilet. The toilets. Uh, and then you can... You can take the video and show This is the second toilet for the men side, inshallah. Uh, so, alhamdulillah, this is the wudu area. Now we come into the wudu area. This is the wudu area, alhamdulillah. Uh, so, we have these spaces here, inshallah. Now we're going to go to the masjid, the men side. This is the men's side toilet, alhamdulillah. As you can see, this is the men uh, masjid for the to uh, for the masjid for the men's side. Uh, we got all the speakers, all the equipment, and all the light is on. The fan is on, uh, alhamdulillah. The carpet is fitted, so. The masjid is kind of ready to be used, inshallah. Uh, uh, let me just get my shoes to go on the other side. Okay, then we have the mashallah, the mimba. You know, this one after we research it, uh, when I went to Saudi, I researched it and the museum of the Prophet and according to the brothers. They have the same one like this, and this after they made the research, the member looks the member of the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi used to look like that, inshallah. So now we're going to go to uh, the, the sister's side of the masjid, inshallah. Uh, give me this, give me this, your, your uh, shoes. Uh, give me this. Hold this yeah, it's easier. No, it's okay, it's okay. So this is the sister's side. Sister's side. Uh, so this is the sister's side. It's a bit small, but Juma like this Juma now we had a lot, a lot of sisters came from the uh, community. So we used upstairs two rooms two rooms for the sisters for Jum'a. So Jum'a, we have extra rooms upstairs they can use, inshallah. So now we finish with the masjid. Uh, this area is going to be tiled 
you know that's why I said them it's not hundred percent work you can see them they're working they're still working so they're going to do the uh, tiling the same as on the other side the white tiling they're going to put the tiling here inshallah so they're working on that now oh yeah we're going to go upstairs now uh, here we're going to put the handrail inshallah the brother's going to be working on that uh, this is one of the things not completed yet inshallah so they're going to do the handrail here inshallah uh, coming up now, this is where the students are going to be studying in the daytime. So they have two rooms. This is where they're going to be reading Quran uh, all day, inshallah. This is like the classrooms. Yeah, inshallah. Uh, this is the other classroom uh, for the students. This is two rooms, and this is the teacher's room inshallah so this is upstairs of the masjid inshallah this is going to, where they're going to be studying barakallahu fikum you know i will send more videos when you see these kids reciting the quran and subhanallah uh, there's about nine children memorized the quran two girls yesterday and we did celebration for them, for the for their memorization. And we did competition, mashallah. The two girls, one of them was the winner, <laughs> mashallah. So, okay, this is kitchen. We can't open it because the sisters are there now. They're cooking. Uh, and these girls cooking is under, you know, 18 years old. And they cook for the students here, mashallah. So, sisters, you know, they were just asking me if you can send us hijabs. And things like that. So, sisters, inshallah, if you have spare hijabs and uh, jilbab, you can send them, inshallah, help them. Um, okay, I think someone's in the shower here, but this is one of the rooms. Uh, one of the rooms at the moment, some of the students are staying here, uh, but this is one of the rooms. Inshallah, the dormitory, yeah. that's where they're going to be sleeping, inshallah. Um, we're going to buy mattresses and other stuff that uh, we just uh, trying to order them, inshallah, for the children to sleep in there. So, yeah, this is the other dormitory, the other room the, the, for the children, where they're going to be sleeping, inshallah. Yeah, and this is... Uh, the imam area, the imam's room, the teacher's uh, house, basically. So this is one of his bedroom, inshallah. And this is other room. He's got four children, so they're going to be staying here. And this is his toilet, inshallah. This is the toilet. You can go inside and let's show a little bit. So this is the imam's house. So. That's the project, inshallah. Uh, we have the same, the other room which is locked. The same one. We have two toilets here for the students. You know, this is two toilets for the students. And then we have another two toilets in that room. I think someone's taking shower there now. Yeah, so this is basically, alhamdulillah, the project itself. There's small things things that we need to do to finish the project inshallah uh, one of the things that you know not now but because the classrooms the classroom is uh, they only have two rooms assalamu alaikum the two rooms uh, at the moment they have two rooms they might use the classroom to sleep as well sometimes but what i want to do inshallah there's a land here for future reference we have a land here on the back uh, we've been speaking with the brother uh, for the land alhamdulillah he was uh, after long negotiation uh, he's the same size as the the land the 
masjid, the dormitory, the whole place here that we have, the masjid is a dormitory. And this one is in the back of the masjid. It's the same size. It starts from here, goes all the way there, and going all the way. So exactly the same size as the uh, building that we have here. So he's asking, after long negotiation, uh, about £3,000, inshallah. So he's asking for three thousand pound. This will be good, inshallah, not to start doing any building now. But if we can secure this, then inshallah, in the future we can build uh, more dormitory uh, for the children, even brothers from the west, if they want to come, uh, send their children to memorize Quran. That's the project we want to do. We want uh, youngsters to come for one year, two years to learn Quran and Arabic specifically. If they want to memorize the Quran, they can come here. So this is what we want to use it for, for future, inshallah. So if anyone wants to help, you know, 3,000 pounds, sadaqah jariya for memorizing the Quran, you know, you can contact him, inshallah. And uh, that's it, I think, inshallah. Barakallah, if you may Allah reward everyone who donated towards this beautiful project, alhamdulillah. People, they really appreciate these things, you know, sometimes... You know, this is why I always say uh, teamwork. This is what, as a Muslims, we always have to work together. And they say every little helps. You know, we had people donated one pound. I had people donated 50p, 70p. I had children, you know, two pound, one pound they, from their pocket money they donated, you know. And we had people donated 10,000 pound as a said, Qajariya. So inshallah it's all for akhirah. The more we work together, the more we will achieve things for this ummah. And it's not for us, it's for the next generation. We have to think about next generation, not about what is good for us now, what will benefit for us. But imagine these kids now, you know, I was interviewing one of the boys that he used to be here. Inshallah I'll send the video. He now he's a big man. You know, memorize Quran, he's working, and he came yesterday to thank us for this project. So these kids will grow up, imagine, they will be teaching communities memorizing Quran. So inshallah, barakallahu fikum, please, let's work together. It doesn't have to be with insight into Islam, for your own community. Work on your community, help your community. Your doctor, see how you can help your community. Your, you, you, you have any profession? See how you can help your masjids, your community. That's how we Muslims will grow, inshallah. Barakallahu fikum. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.